In this video, we will learn how to rename multiple files. Uh, here you can see uh, there are 50 files. Uh, all the files ending with MP4. Actually, this is a MP3. So I want to rename each file MP4 to MP3. That's the first problem with these uh, file names. Second problem is that when all the uh, file names contain science stories, I want to just remove that one. I don't want that one. Just to get rid of that. Third problem is uh, here you can see uh, it is starting with the uh, uh, 01.01. .01. Here uh, first 01 is a, a season number. Second 01 is a episode number so what i want is that one i want to change uh, i want to add s here and remove the dot and add e here this change i want to make second uh, i already uh, mentioned i want to remove this part uh, then i want to change this to three like that i want to do Okay, these these are uh, these three changes I want to make in each file. There are fifty files, so it will be difficult to go through each file and change it. So I want to do it in the batch mode. For that, what do you need is that you need uh, a command called a rename. Basically, it's a, a Perl package. Uh, here you can see rename renames multiple files. A rename renames the file name supplied according to the rule specified as the first argument. The Perl expression argument is a Perl expression which is expected to modify the dollar underscore string in Perl for at least some of the file names specified. If a given file name is not modified by the expression, it will not be renamed. If no file names are given on the command line, file names will be read via standard input okay that let us skip that part so here uh, they have given uh, two examples you can see uh, to rename all files matching uh, star dot back to strip the extension you might say so uh, use the command name rename then s substitute uh, this is a pattern uh, dot back uh, string ends and here they didn't give anything that means empty replace empty and they are mentioning what and all uh, files you need to choose for uh, this re uh, this renaming here all the files ending with the dot back uh, another example they have given some uh, to translate uppercase names to lower you would use this one let's go back to command line here uh, uh, these are the 50 files so I, I will do one thing first I will uh, send these file names to a file called the file names dot txt so we need to uh, later these names okay so there are uh, three parts we need to change here so you can use rename s uh, s forward slash here you want to add find and here you want to add a replace what you want to replace and uh, you can use the g uh, global everywhere then here you can give star dot mp4 then it will uh, look for all the mp3 mp4 uh, file in this folder and it will search for this pattern and it will replace this one so you can write a uh, regular expression that uh, will do all these three things together or you can uh, uh, do one by one first you change the uh, file extension then uh, remove the science stories part then uh, re uh, add the season and episode so it will be difficult uh, uh, whether it will work or not and all so what what i will do is that one I will open that uh, file. Uh, we just added all the file names. Okay, I will copy this one. Now uh, go to 
uh, you can go to regex 101.com so here you can experiment with your regular expression you may not be able to come uh, with the regular expression quickly so you can copy here then uh, uh, try your uh, regular expression first i want to change the uh, mp3 mp4 so here you can add uh, dot mp4 and end the uh, mp4 mp4 and end the string here now here you, here you can see a match information uh, it's starting match 1 till match 50 so it means it is covering all the 50 files and it uh, sorry 50 lines we have only over oh, here added a file name also i will remove that one okay uh, okay it is matching all the 50 lines it means our uh, regular expression is correct now you can go to uh, here i will close that gedit so use the rename s yes. uh, we wrote that regular expression there uh, dot m p 4 ending the string and we will replace with dot m p 3 you don't need to add g here because only once we are doing here then you specify all the files star dot m p 4 basically we are look, uh, looking for all the m p 4 files and changing uh, dot m p 4 to dot m p 3 okay i am going to change this one i think everything is okay okay now you can go to file here yeah you can see uh, everything is changed or uh, you can see mp3 mp3 we changed all the file extension now second part what we want to do is that we want to change the science stories uh, add here uh, science stories comma so you can go here and see here it's a total 50 and you can see all the science stories covering here and uh, uh, science story is not uh, uh, present anywhere else in the file name so we can replace that one so go here rename forward slash science science stories comma space uh, we don't we want to add blank there we don't we won't remove that part so i won't add anything here here i won't add anything so blank uh, we'll close that uh, star dot mp3 we renamed extension so science stories this is a pattern we are searching and we are uh, empty adding it means blank adding uh, I hope it is good. I'll go. Yeah. Now you can go to here. You can see that removed all the science stories. Everything. Now third part is that you need to change. Uh, we you need to add a season here and uh, uh, E S. Uh, you need to add s and e so what you can do is that one you can you can uh, add the s uh, beginning of the string and uh, after uh, dot you you can replace dot with uh, first dot with uh, e that's one way you can go another way is that one i will uh, first way is this one uh, search for the beginning and uh, you will see here 50 and uh, replace uh, s then s will come everywhere first then uh, second thing you can do is that one look for a dot and uh, add uh, here uh, you using g don't use the g uh, basically uh, g here uh, uh, the, here you can use the g there if you are going to rename uh, here you can see that one oh they didn't add here at the end you can add the g they didn't add so we also didn't add here 
so if you don't add that one they will look for only ones you can see only ones they took each file they will look only ones okay so uh, you can replace this with the space e that's one way but i will go another uh, way so that you you will see how to handle more complex cases so what you need to do is that one start with uh, uh, string starting and uh, look for the d uh, one or more uh, dot again d one or more so basically you want to or you can see here uh, match information it's covering all the 50 and you can look here almost 50 is there right so basically we, we want to uh, get this part and this part and uh, replace with s first part space e second part so basically you need to group it for that purpose so that uh, you will get the first part and uh, here second part so if you looking here you can see that one match one group one group two so go to end you can see here group one is a uh, season 5 and uh, episode is a 10 so this is the error expression we want to use now rename s uh, starting the string uh, starting the group t one or more uh, digits uh, literally dot literal dot and uh, group another group starts uh, digits one or more digits ending the groups so basically it will look for the pattern like this and it will tell this is a group one uh, this is a group two so what we want here is that first we, we want to replace with the s season first group we want to represent here you can use the dollar one dollar one will represent the first group then we want to put space e dollar uh, two is the second group Okay, that's all. Uh, star dot mp. This is a file name. Everything is good, right? Uh, first group, uh, second group, s first group, e second group. Hope everything good. Yeah, we got that one. Uh, season one, uh, episode one. Go to the end. Uh, season five, episode ten. The Bond Wars. We re, uh, we change the extension from MP4 to MP3. We removed the uh, science stories uh, that extra part, and we change the uh, number dot number to season number dot space. We added S and D there. That's all. So basically, you can use uh, this regex one to one uh, to experiment with uh, whether it's uh, working fine or not. Yeah, basically we splitted that uh, problem into three parts and we conquer one by one. Uh, otherwise, what you can do is that one. Uh, you, I will show here. You can go to file names. Okay, this is a uh, original file names. You can use like this. Mm, start the string. Uh, you can uh, one shot. You can solve all the problem, but that will be very com complex so uh, I, I will show in the regex one to one so i will copy all this thing i will paste here so uh just now we solved by as a three problems i'll solve with one one first one shot itself so here you can see that first we covered the uh we matched the season and uh, episode then what you need to do is that one space science stories comma then add second uh, group uh, dot star let it cover everything okay then at the end dot mp4 um,
yeah uh, mp4 now it will cover everything and uh, you can go to match information part here you can go here and you can see everything see first uh, it is group one is a season group two is a uh, episode and the rest of the title uh, by removing the science stories you can verify everything okay now you can copy this one uh, go to command line i will close this one i'll paste that one here so here then what you will do Uh, this is a regular expression. Let me check it if it's working or not. I will add x, replace, uh, search for this uh, regular expression and replace it, replace x just for testing purpose. Uh, you can see that pattern not found. The reason is that when there is a bit different uh, syntax for the regular expression in VI. Basically, what you need to do is escape this bracket, escape the plus, escape this one escape this also escape this escape escape this one escape this one this is how you now you can see they selected the first line this is a uh, some changes for the vi regular expression now what you can do here is that add s yes, dollar one sorry here we use a slash backward slash one instead of dollar one uh, e slash two slash 3 uh, basically this one a main title then add dot mp3 so basically you need to use uh, this regular expression um, and replace with this regular expression uh, to rename uh, in, in one shot rather than make it as a three part this is just for uh, demo purpose I'm showing I, I think it's better to go a uh, three in the three section uh, that will be easier for you to do that rather than writing such a complex uh, regular expression now you can see it replace everything okay I hope this uh, session was useful for you Play one. Christmas, as everyone knows, was invented by Charles Dickens. Well, thanks for watching.